Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Steve Hensley. First at four, the state Supreme Court heard oral arguments today in the case involving the contested 2014 Judge Executive's race in McGoffin County. Judge Executive Charles Doc Harden would be forced from office if the Supreme Court upholds the ruling of lower courts. WIMT's Matthew Rand joins us now with more. That's right. Over the course of about an hour of oral arguments, justices heard competing versions of the events surrounding the November 2014 general election in McGoffin County. Charles Doc Hardin won the 2014 election by just 28 votes, with a strong showing from absentee voters. His opponent, John Montgomery, challenged the results in court. Montgomery's attorney told justices Wednesday both the volume of absentee ballots and the way they were counted are red flags for election fraud. The law is very clear. There must be substantial compliance with the voting statutes regarding absentee ballots because Fraud generally occurs in absentee ballots. That didn't occur in this case. Hardin's attorney told justices the election was voided based on speculation and suspicion with no evidence of any wrongdoing. They did not bring in one witness, not one witness, to say that my absentee ballot was forged or irregular or anything else. This is a case of no proof. We'll have much more on this story coming up tonight at 6. For now, reporting in Frankfurt, Matthew Rand, WYMT Mountain News. Though his office was ordered vacant, Hardin has been able to remain in office through the appeals process.